And welcome to Cruise Ship Tycoon, where it's time your boy builds and buys the biggest and best ship the world has ever seen. I'm sick and tired and fed up of having a terrible cruise ship. Today is the day we build the biggest, the best, most luxurious ship you've ever seen and turn it into a five star hotel on the water. Now, if you guys enjoy this, then smash that like button down below. If you're new in here, then make sure you subscribe, because guys, this one is gonna be a beastly one. I'm gonna be spending millions. I've got seven million in the bank, and this is my weak, weak ship. I use this to try and turn it into a speed demon. Didn't quite work out that way. So we're gonna buy the biggest, the best ship in the game right now, which is a new one. I think it's called like the Albatross or something like that. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, that's what I've been told. I don't think it actually is. If I go to manage mode, buy a new ship. Mm. Yes, it is called the Albatross class. Now it's four million. The Osprey was the biggest, the best before, and this one is even bigger and a better. I also expect it to be a lot slower, but it doesn't matter. This is going to be luxury, guys. You've never seen luxury like this in your whole entire life right now. Five stars. It's going to be a beautiful five stars. Fancy. So I think it's time we buy this then. Because I'm going to make sure that, one, everybody comes on, has an amazing experience, and just loves my little hotel on the water. Because that's what a cruise ship is, right? It's a hotel on the water. Four million. Oh, so if I if I buy this for four million, I'll get a million back from selling my current ship. Let's do this. And it's now been done, guys. It's now been done. Look at the size of this ship. This boat is ridiculous. It is ridiculous. It is so freaking huge. But are we ready to turn it into a five star perfection? Five stars. Hotel on the water. With your boy, the captain. Guys, we're going to make so much freaking cash money moolah on this boat. So much freaking cash money moolah. So first things first, then we got to make sure that one, it's got the powers, it's got the engines, it's got the might. It can move on the sea. So we're in edit mode right now. This bottom floor is where we're going to store all the... Is there nothing on this boat? There is literally nothing on there from the big... Oh, no! Oh! There's not even bottom part. Okay, right. These are the engines. So I think we need to build a few more engines. You know what I mean? Right, engines. Let's buy. So we've got a couple there. We'll build two more here. We'll do another four. They're expensive, but you know what? We need the power, boys. We need the power. Now, the problem with the engines is it sucks up a lot of juice. We need so many uh, fuel tanks in this. Right, I think that's enough engines, I think. I think that's enough engines. We need some fuel tanks. Let me go over the big boy fuel tanks. Uh, three, four. And we'll do another two rows. Because we've got to make sure that with all these engines sucking up all this fuel, we're going to make sure we've got to be able to, uh, you know, get to where we need to get to. So we've got a lot of fuel uh, we can have saved up there. We're going to have batteries. Battery packs are what we use for an extra boost um, from the power. So we, we can have a little bit of electric and slightly save the planet. So we also need solar panels. Solar panels will start recharging these batteries, give the batteries their extra power, and then we we go like a couple of miles an hour faster than normal. I think they, is it kilowatts in this game uh, or whatever it is or knots? I think it's knots is how you travel by the speed of boat, right? I think so. Right, we got all this space open here over here, which I'm going to use this space right now. Uh, where is it? Where is is it in utilities? The freezer. That's what we need. We'll go for the big boy freezers. This is where we store the food so nobody goes hungry on the ship. So I get a couple of these added in. And we do one there. So just get a couple of these added in. We need lots of food to serve all our guests the fanciest delicious treats the world has ever seen. Again, fancy delicious treats. I'm talking like caviar. I'm talking like tacos. I mean, ta can you class tacos fancy? I kind of do. Because <laughs> it's amazing. It's amazing food. All right, let's get the, the remainder of these batteries in. And I think then this is all done. What I will do 
is we'll go to the very top floor. This boat's going to be heavy. We'll go to the very top floor right now. And we'll put some solar panels on here so we can start recharging the battery. But it has just gone nighttime. So it's not really going to recharge much. Wait, was there other options I could choose from? Oh, a 35 kilowatt one. Yes, boy, we'll go for the 35 kilowatt one. All right, these are tiny. These are cute. But it is nighttime. So we kind of have to wait until daytime uh, before we can start charging the batteries. Okay, they're charging a little bit, not by much. But I'm going to place a load of these down, boys. A load of these down. I think the light turned on is an indication there's not much sun in the sky right now. Leave that to light that right now. There's a lot of solar panels. And that will slowly charge the batteries. Now, it will take a long time before they're fully recharged. I can pay to get them fully recharged anyway. But I think we are now pretty much ready to build the luxurious route. This is a huge boat. This is a huge ship. There is so many floors right now. It's unbelievable. Right. I think first things first then. Do I create the staircase? I'm going to have to kind of create the staircase, aren't I? So, build. What is this? Where's the staircase? Is it walls, floors, utilities? Yes. And Oh, we've got a stairwell. We have an outdoor staircase, which I kind of like for it to be like an indoor staircase too. That would kind of work. So let's go up a deck. And okay, we got we got to pick or figure out where we want it. I could do it at the very back of the ship. Uh, all of this. If I go down the deck, and if I pull it, let's say one there. Is that the middle? Yeah, that is actually the middle. And if I go up now, we have that there. So if I go down. And does that work? Oh, boys. Yes. Yes, it freaking does. Down. Down. Okay, no, I can't place it there. So if I do it there. Yes, sir. All right, this is dope. This is freaking dope. This is now going to be my staircase. It's a weird staircase. I will, I will, I will give you that. Right, I don't need to get down to there, but it goes all the way to the freaking top floor. Yes, mate. Yes. So let's go down one deck here, and I'm going to choose this one to be our first set of rooms. Now, we need to make sure that we've got an elaborate one. Like it's really fancy. We're giving the best of the best. And I think we only really get that by doing the suites, which is a ridiculous size room. It's a nice state room with a built-in balcony, which sounds freaking amazing. So the built-in balcony goes here, and it fits in wonderful. Just like that. How glorious is this? So I think I'll get a couple of these in. Again, look what's inside. I can see... Um, Wait, there's two bedrooms with double beds in. There's a huge widescreen TV. Uh, and then there's a normal TV in... Oh, my God. <laughs> Look at that. There's TVs. For, there's, like, three TVs in these whole entire rooms. There's some sofa, some chairs. There's two ensuite bathrooms in this really, really big balcony area. Whoever's in those rooms are living luxury. So I could place him uh, the same on the other side. But you kind of got to be careful with how I've, I've done the stairs. So if I treat it as this here, I leave that little space slightly open. Because with that open space, I can plant some other stuff inside of it, which would be kind of nice, dope, and pretty damn sweet. And we'll leave the extra space in just there, because I might do another stairwell going down. Like one on both sides, they'll get to where they need to get to a lot quicker. Now, if I cover that top deck right there with those beautiful suites, they're going to love that. We go down a deck right now. Now, I might choose these sing no, the mini suites. So we can have four passengers in the in the in the big ones. There's a small part of me that wants to do the you know this is luxury. There's no point in me doing a room any less than this. Because I'm trying to build a five-star crow ship. So I, I need to make sure you know I'm doing all of it. Don't even care, mate. Don't even care. So, boom goes you. We'll fill up this floor now with these. 
and the floors down below will start to do some luxury entertainment now we do need to do the staff quarters as well we need to make sure the staff is all set up can i get i can't get that one in just there that's okay so continue push this down right now so i think we're going to have enough space and time and movement to play around to get the other staircase in i think i should place that in next shouldn't i yeah so let's do it next thing. So utilities. <coughs> now do we go for a steel stairwell or the carpet one? Ooh, let's go for the carpet one. That's that's luxury. That's definitely luxury. So I'm gonna make sure, yeah, we can work with this. We can work with this. So I place one in there and one in there. I don't even know how that ends up. Okay, wonderful. That works. So where did that go? <laughs> I'm trying to figure this out now, right now. So if that went there, down, boom, it's about there. So up, yes. Yes, yes, yes. So there you go. And then we go down. And I think it's there. Yeah. Your boy's on a home run right now. And down, which is about there. Right. Right, get in the game. Right, do I need to go down by one more? Or should we? No, we'll leave that. No, we'll go down by one more. Because I'll put like some other entertainment stuff down here. So upper deck. And boom. It's about there. Am I right? Nailed it. Nailed it. Nailed it all the time. All the time. And then don't need to go down by one more. That's fine. That is literally fine. Right, let's go back up to here. Then we got the nice big suites in. So the next floor down. Uh, we'll have some. We'll have the food in. The food can go there. So we've got a bunch of different um, options right now. We've got a taco stand, a burger place, or a pizzeria. So let's get the uh, Desquakitos. I can't even say that there, but it's, it's the taco stand right now. The beautiful taco stand. So if I do one, two, three on that side. I'm getting. I'm making sure there's enough taco stands in here, boys. you got to make sure there's enough at all times. And then we do one, two, three free nice uh we'll do the pizzeria next it's a big boy one one two three gotta make sure there's enough pizza on this ship we we have to make sure of that one two three nice and then we got the burger place the burger joint boys the burger joint so one two Three, four. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be so good, so good. And now all the little spacing that we have is where we then place all the little tables and chairs in. So let's go for the apportioned one. No, let's go for the the parasol one. Oh, now that's a little bit more fancy, a little bit more expensive. So we're gonna get all of this now in for the little dining room. We're only giving them the best of the best, boys. The best of the best is what these guys deserve because they're paying so much goddamn money to come and um, sail with your boy. we got to offer that luxury. So let's get a nice little row just in here. Nice little row just in there. And you kind of think that's enough tables and chairs? I kind of think so. I kind of think so. So that's kind of done for that. We'll roll with that. I'll get all the decorations in a little bit later and stuff like that. But then the deck down, we want to then do. We've done the food. Now it's time for the activities. And why don't we get this small theater in? So we've got a nice little cinema that we can throw in. And why don't we do multiple theaters? So one, two, three, four. So we could show four different films at one freaking time. That's cool. No. Let's do five, six. Six different films at one single time. That's dope. Then we got a drinks bar. So it's pretty much the same. You just, you just you know, changing the design of it. So we do one. What is it? It's a four wide, isn't it? Yeah. Two. Three. And then we do the one on the opposite side. Boom. 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 So... We bag them onto each other, so it looks kind of dope. We gotta do a nice little tables and chairs area as well, but we then get to do a bowling alley next. That's glorious. 
Right. Where do, how do I do the bowling alley? Should I do... Let's do it like... Um, one, two. Where's the door for this? Oh, it's there. And then... Right, we'll just do two for there. That's fine, because it is a little bit big. It, it's huge. And let's get some giant chess tables down there. So again, guys, I'm just thinking luxury for days. Luxury for days right now. So that's nice. They'll enjoy that. We'll get some hot tubs down. Ooh, this is quite funky. We get Should we get two hot tubs in the window? Like that. Nice, nice. Let's go to the other end as well. This boat is so freaking huge. It takes you a million gazillion hours later to get to where you need to get to. Right, boom, boom, then boom. Boom, and then um, boom. <laughs> it's all over the place, but thou love those hot tubs. We're gonna get a swimming pool in, but we've also got shuttle boards. All right, see, all right, see. Let's get them in this little gap here. A load of shuttle boards. Man, we're giving them so much to freaking do in here. It's crazy. So I want to get a swimming pool in. So let's go a deck down for this, and we have different size swimming pools. So this is the biggest swimming pool we can get in, um, which will place the, oh no, I can't, need room, in it. What's, what's below? Aha, okay, so I can't get on this floor, um, that's okay, but what I could do, I could get it on this floor, which it fits beautifully across, but there's going to be a staircase there, isn't there? Yeah. So if I get it there, because it kind of kills the floor below, but that's okay. Plenty of room, plenty of space. I just need a staircase to get up to it. That's what I need at this point. So staircase going up. So we go down. Boom. And that should be fine. Just there. This is going to be so damn good. This is going to be so damn good. Right. On the top deck then, furnishings, we need the little sun beds. So we go with the doubles. I'm going to go down a floor just here. So boom. Get a load of these in right now. Make this look freaking glorious. My solar panels are going up too, which is good. So I'm making that delicious power, boys. All right, nice. Let's get some hot tubs. So is it in activities? Yes. We can get... Oh, a square one. Boys. Well, this is fancy. We got a couple there. I'm trying to like mirror it either side, which looks kind of dope. Okay, let's get a chessboard in, in the middle, just because we can. So it'd be nice to get um, some hot tubs up here as well. And some of those deck chairs as well. That would be kind of dope. So furnishing, let's get some of these up here. Let's turn it around, boom. Boom, and then a couple just there. Not bad. Let's go down a couple of floors. Uh, I've got to get down to this floor, right? Yeah, let's get some just in here. I don't think there's a door on this side, is there? No, but I'm just getting these in for the decorations, boy. For the decorations. So it is already quite good. What are we actually now missing? Let's go through this then. So we've got, well, we don't need to do any of that, but we've got rooms. We need to get the, oh, the bathroom. That's what we need in next. I'll go for the big bathroom. So we should have little spots where we can drop a bathroom in. Just like that. Upper deck. Uh, bathroom. You know they've got bathrooms in their rooms, but we're always going to make sure we've got bathrooms in nearby. Um, I do some bathrooms in here because this is like the bit where they're lounging. So we know nice a few bathrooms in there. One near the pool area just here. And let's go down where we've got this in. So if I turn that just there. Bathroom just there. We'll do a bathroom just there. And is it possible to squeeze one in on this side? Yeah. So rooms are a little bit crazy all over the place. But this is pure luxury, boys. Right, we need to get uh, some tables and chairs just down here quickly. So go on the power cell again. Because we need, because we got a bar and stuff around here, so we kind of need all that jazz. Throwing one just there and there and there. 
I like to like decorate him and kind of move things around. And they're playing The Godfather. Damn, what? Got some glorious films on the go right now. All right, boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. And then we need to make the place beautiful. So uh, we got a replica of the ship we can place in. There. How much is that, by the way? You get one free. What, I got one more for free? Is that what they're trying to tell me? Is that what they're trying to tell you, boy? Right, where can I place this? Maybe up here. Uh, I'll place it where the bathrooms are. So if you're waiting for the bathroom to be available... Oh, no, you only get one as a limit. Okay, I get ya. So, should we get some plants in? Let's get a couple of plants in. So, I'm going to dot these around quite generously in the room. So, you know, again, it gets the reputation up. It makes them enjoy the place a little bit more. We can make it sparkle. We can make it sparkle, boys. So, a couple of those just there. Nice. Let's... <laughs> uh, Done a couple of round over here. Right. So I've got so many trees in. Right. Go crazy over here again. Go crazy again, boys. And uh, we'll just go crazy around here. And is there anything I've actually missed? So activities, we got all this. Cloven store, of course. We're missing a cloven store. Do I have room and oh, oh, we've got this whole deck we haven't even used. Okay. Right, I'm going to do a cloven store there, there, and there, and then one just there. I'm creating these weird little alley, you know, alleyways of that. Rooms? I need to do this, the crew room, don't I? Yeah. So let's get a couple of crew rooms set up. So this is where the staff of the ship lay their head to rest. Right, there we go. Get a couple of those in. And I think that is then all I need, right? I mean, I could do one of these smokestacks or whale things. They don't really add to it, but they kind of do, like, decoration to the place. But they can really uh, bulk us all up a little bit more. Right, I'm going to have to kind of uh, delete these guys. Right, remove. Boom, boom. Place that big tail just there. Nice. That's kind of dope. That is kind of dope. Right, nothing else I need is there. There is nothing else I need at this point. So I can get out of um, edit mode right now. This boat is going to be so freaking glorious. Uh, should I paint it? I don't know. Manage. Right, crew. We need a captain. Higher. We need a navigator. Higher. We need an officer. An officer. An officer. Uh, an officer and an officer. There we go. All on there. Uh, clean the housekeeping. Um coming soon no housekeeping closet oh wait do i have to build a housekeeping closet did i miss that uh build right utilities ha ha i did right okay let's go right back down to the bottom quickly all right let's get a couple of these in housekeeping closets nice let's get out of edit mode so manage here we go higher Higher, higher, higher. <laughs> right, housekeeping in. So these guys are the ones that, like, they clean the rooms when a guest has left or in the morning they make the beds and stuff like that. That's dope. Uh, supplies. Uh, cost. Dock to ship. Um, well, we want maximum. How do I kind of buy them? Oh, dock. There we go. Oh, my God, it's expensive. Right, the remaining... Well, to get all the supplies, 43 Gs. Right, let's buy that. Damn, that was expensive. Um, the battery is price is slowly going down as we slowly, slowly, slowly recharge it. So I'm going to buy the fuel. Um, I'll set a route up in just a moment. Last thing I'm going to do then in the edit mode. Let's go up at the decks right now. Is we're going to edit... Oh, no, oh, man. I was right in there for a second. Power, solar panels. Let's get a couple more in. Because this is what really gives us um, the battery power. And the more I've got, uh, the more the less I have to pay. Because it charges even quicker. So you get f I'm getting 35, is it like megawatts from each one? So it all helps. It all freaking helps, right? This boat is ridiculous. Right, 
Let's buy the remaining power then. All right, buy that, it's done. Let's create a new route. There we go. And we're going to go uh, from here to Orion City. And do I resupply, refuel? No, I w no, I don't, okay, I won't do any of that. We'll then go to, to this island and we'll refuel, recharge, resupply. We'll also get rid of passengers. Do I change up passengers? I think so. Uh, we'll go to this island as well. So you can see there the route that we have now taken. Glorious. And I'll just do passengers. No, actually, I won't. Actually, do you know what? I won't do any passengers. Because when I get back there, I'll get bonuses for those passengers, which will be kind of dope. And then we'll take the passengers off. Recharge, read supply. That is done. I'm ready for that. It's 9.4 nautical miles. Okay. Revenue, we'll see coming soon. Ratings. So this I know that these ratings never change because they're not fully implemented. But we can all guarantee this is a five-star cruise ship right now. So passengers, let's load the passengers. I can get 30 passengers on. Let's load those guys. And I'm thinking, right, before we do go, do I add in a few more? We've got the passengers there right now. They're going to get some delicious food. Because I've got a little bit of room down here for some extra rooms. Now, do I go single cabins? Legally, you can fit one passenger in here. <laughs> um, let's go double cabin. And I'm just going to fill it all in because it's all literally about getting the maximum passengers. Well, not maximum. I don't want to do maximum passengers. But it's a couple more, you know, because I'm trying to uh, make money. So I've, if I just kind of... Um, Run you put them like that. Nobody needs to know. They're on the they're on the bottom deck, so yeah, it don't matter. Um, right, manage. I have to. I'm gonna have to unload quickly, and then load again to bring the extra ones on. My base fare is 148,000. Okay, right. I've got all the crew right. Yeah, supplies. I've got. Okay, I'll buy a few extra right now. Roots, we're going to activate. Autopilot is enabled. Oh my god, what is going on? Uh, are we going? Did we go? Haha! -ha! Okay. Now we're setting sail. I might, I've, got, I've got a pilot doing this, by the way, guys. My pilot's doing this. Or my captain, should I say. Um, hopefully we don't run out of fuel or anything like that before we get to the next place. Because that would kind of slightly be embarrassing. Now, I'm not driving the ship. Um, the dude's doing it for me. But we're travelling at 21 knots. Which is not amazing. It's not amazing. But, again, I can just now low-key. Sit back, relax, and just watch the cash money roller roll in. I realized I did the autopilot kind of wrong. Uh, if I go to now manage and uh, edit the route, I realized when it was red lines, it means it was going to crash. So I've had to add in additional points. Uh, this point was a little bit too crazy. I've just had to manually control this one. But he's now going to hopefully follow this line beautifully and dock up on the next island. I can only pray... It's going to do that. I can only pray. Uh, time will tell. Uh, is he now driving the boat? He's meant to be driving the boat, my dude. Activate. Right. Autopilot activated. Is he now? Yeah, he's now moving. He should follow it beautifully. And I haven't got to do nothing about it right now. I mean, hopefully. <laughs> you just never freaking know. You just never freaking know at this point. I'm trying to find the best way to take a nice little screenshot of this. Because this is a freaking glorious cruise ship right now. Freaking glorious, I tell you. It's so damn big. So damn huge. 
peeps are loving it. The peeps are loving it. Maybe I should run down a little bit further. Right, can I can I parkour it? Yes, boys! I just parkoured it. Hardcore parkour! Right, my dude is now driving the boat. And hopefully he doesn't crash anywhere. I bet you he's still going to crash. But we're moving to the next island! <laughs> oh, dear God, what have I done? What have I done? Create a monster with this luxurious five-star ship. It's beautiful. It's beautiful, boys. I just need to keep going. He's, he's following the line now, anyway. If I check the map, he's definitely following the line. It's just going to take me a million, million years to get to Placeholder Island 2. I mean, we all want to go there on holiday, right? Placeholder Island 2. So, hurry up your phone! I think he's driving now with four beans. Yeah. Oh my god, I made 170,000 cash money molars uh, from this uh, this journey so far. Haven't really gone that far. Haven't really gone that far, guys. If I check the map right now, I'm closing on a placeholder island too. It's currently 2 a.m. in the morning. The sun should be rising very soon. Very, very, very soon right now. And uh, I think everybody, I think the majority of people... Are in are having sleeps are sleepsies right now unless people are, are jamming. Uh, these are the two. Where's the food one? The food one's down here. Is there more people down here? No, it's it's a quite calm and quiet and calm and quiet and calm atmosphere. And I kind of like it. I do kind of like it. Right, we're approaching the island anyway. So let me get right back up to the top because I, I got your boys got to see. I gotta see where we landed. Look at this. Now, will it dock? Okay. Will it manage to do it? That's going to be interesting. I want to see how good it is at doing this. Oh, I think it is going to do it. I think it is, boys. I'm going to have to give my captain a raise. That's how freaking good he is right now. I'm going to have to give him a freaking raise, boys. So here we go. We're about to duck. And it's almost... Well, it's on the way to being 6 a.m. in the morning. Right. Now, what's interesting is now, at this point, he restocks, he refuels, recharges, and gets the supplies ready as well. And then he does he set sail off again, or do I have to like tell him to do it himself after? We're going to find out, boys. We're going to find out. Right. Any moment now, he will duck. He's taking his time. He's definitely taking his time. Um, you done, boy? You done? So close. Just, just straight. There we go. He did it, boys. He's purchased everything. And is he about to set sail once again? I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure if he sets sail once again right now. Uh, yeah, he's on the move again. I ain't going to do nothing, boys. I can just sit back, relax, take a nice, delicious sip of my cup of tea. And just chill out. Guys. Hope you did enjoy my amazing cruise ship. If you did, smash that like button down below. And until next time. I'll see you all soon. So, good. Listen. <laughs>